Hello folks, my name is Matt Smith. I'm the head of instruction here at the Otisaga's Leather Stocking Golf Course. Hope you're all doing well. I uh, wanted to give you a couple more drills today um, while we have this downtime. Um, today's drill, I want you, I'd like you to focus on getting to a finished position. During the golf swing, as we're swinging the golf club, we've got so many different swing thoughts, you know, setup thoughts, positions that we're in during our backswing. And quite often, a lot of times, the ball becomes the target and we forget to finish our golf swings properly. So a simple drill I'd like you to do if you're putting is rock the shoulders, swing the club, frame the finish. Frame the finish like so. The best putters on tour control their speeds with solid ball strikes and you'll notice the Jordan Spieth, Justin Thomas, Tiger Woods, they all frame their finish. They hold that finished position after they struck the ball. It ensures a little bit better contact. Also when you're hitting pitch shots, chip shots, be crisp with it and frame the finish. Rotate to the target, rotate your shoulders, frame that finish. By doing it with your wedge game, you'll be able to control your trajectory a little bit better and help ensure more solid contact. And then finally, working on getting to a finished position with the full swing. Turn, release that energy towards the target, let all your weight end up in that left heel. My belt buckle, nose, and right knee are all facing the target, and I've released that right heel. You can see the entirety of my, my uh, right foot there. So just work on getting to a finished position. It'll help ensure that the ball be do doesn't become the target for you, and hopefully create some more solid strikes.